Joe Pistori sees love for baseball is nearly as old as he is. Literally since I was born, that's what my first word was ball. And, and growing up, uh, for the first two years after I could talk, everything was ball. So I would just call everything ball. So my parents and my mom would always tell you that I've been playing since I was born. Pistorisi was originally drafted by the White Sox out of high school in the 44th round in 2011. But he decided continuing his education at Washington State was the right decision at the time. At that age, um, anytime you can get some publicity from a major league team, it's pretty cool. But um, I, I always wanted to get my degree, and um, I'm glad that I got to go to WSU, and the time I spent there was really great. So. Pistorisi was then selected in the 17th round of the 2015 draft by the team he grew up loving, the Seattle Mariners. I used to always go to the games, and uh, I got to go to games in the Kingdom, and uh, then at Safeco when I was growing up, so getting drafted by the Mariners was huge for me. I've always been a Ken Griffey fan, so it's pretty awesome. And although he's had an outstanding amount of support from both his family and his friends, there's one specific family member that he owes it all to, his biggest fan. My grandma has been following my games since I was at WSU, and now she I know follows my games now that I'm a Mariner. She even dressed up as him for a costume party at her retirement home. From Montana to the big leagues, each day with the Mariners is living out a childhood dream. I used to talk to my buddies growing up about how one day I'd be playing, um, and I told them I was going to be playing on some big name team. And, and now I'm here, and so it's really exciting. And I get to text my friends every day and tell them that you know I got to see Robinson Cano, like take bats. And while training in Arizona, Pistorisi has learned to appreciate growing up in the small town of Kalispell even more than he ever has. Um, I love Montana. The people there are so great, and. Uh, I think coming down here, you, you notice that a little bit more. Um, it can get a little hectic down here in Arizona. When he was younger, Pistorisi was diagnosed with attention deficit disorder. Unfortunately, back in September, he violated the minor league baseball drug prevention and treatment program. This occurred while he was taking Adderall, which was prescribed by his doctor. Although the left-hander was suspended 50 games for this miscommunication, he's ready to move forward with the next season and represent the Treasure State in a positive light. I think that it's all about the process. I think they, they stress that a lot as Mariners here, and so I think that if I can just go out and work hard every day, that I know the outcome will be great. And I think that Montana has been putting together a lot of better athletes. Just being one of those big names is always really good. Um, and anything that I can do that's positive would be is great. Reporting from spring training, Susie Milano, MTN Sports.